What's going on Star Wars fans? You're watching The Collector's Hut. My name is Chris. I'm back again with another Star Wars The Force Awakens action figure review. Now these are the droids you're looking for. C-3PO, R2-D2, 3PO has his red arm. I don't know what's going on with it. I can't wait to find out. I'm wearing this shirt. It's very necessary for this review. I'm really excited so let's get right to it. So like I say all the time, I love these packages because you can take the figure out and put it right back in. It looks like you never opened it. So uh, you get a really sweet picture of both of them, another picture on the back, and a brief description, which we're all very familiar with both of them. Check that out. And some other figures that you can pick up. Alright, so let's get right to it. We'll start off with C-3PO because I'm pumped about his red arm. And he looks awesome. So this is a very basic figure, five points of articulation. His head goes left to right, arms up and down, legs up and down. Now this black under his hands, which is pretty cool, I just noticed that now. Looks pretty neat. Both arms look exactly the same, just the color is different. I don't see any extra things on it. And I know what you guys are thinking, it looks like he just dipped his arm in red paint, but guess what? I think it's awesome. This is the first figure that we got from the new movie, so to me it's a must have. Now, I got lucky and I actually found this pack at uh, Target. So if you guys see it, definitely pick it up. It's totally worth it. I know they're very basic figures and we all have like 50 C-3PO's and R2-D2's, but you can never have enough. And come on guys, he has a red arm. and we'll just keep on cruising. So R2 comes with this crazy like cannon thing. Um, I have no idea if this is gonna be in the new movie. It looks crazy though. So it rests right on his shoulders and you just sit it right on there as, as so. And uh, yeah, I mean this dude looks like he's rolling into a war and is gonna be destroying stuff. Now the tips, are like very soft and flimsy as you can see and you just press down on the missile boom watch out so yeah I mean I think it's pretty cool I wonder if it's gonna be in the new movie I mean this little guy always has something up his sleeve and um, so I wouldn't blow it past him to have something really crazy some special modifications so as far as the articulation goes with R2 his legs just go up and down like that. There's no third leg option and none of these compartments open. Very standard figure. His head, full 360. But I think he looks great. A little something right here but nothing opens like I say beep boop bop okay and I will hold them next to each other because they are awesome I cannot wait to see them that these two again I really can it's gonna be awesome and especially with the new edition of BB-8 so it's gonna be the three of them it's gonna be unbelievable So hell yeah, definitely pick this up if you guys see it. It's just great. Our two favorite droids. All right guys, well, I really hope that you enjoyed this review. And uh, please let me know what you think about these figures. 
Please subscribe, comment, and share. I love hearing from you guys. The support is incredible. And uh, you can follow me on Twitter, at Collectors Hut. I'm also on Instagram. You could uh, go to thecollectorshut.com, and that will bring you right to the YouTube channel. So um, I'm easy enough to find. Thank you so much for tuning in. Stay tuned. I have a ton of stuff to come. May the force be with you, and I'll see you soon. Thanks.